So we start here from this point where we explain how digital twin works. So starting from the development, the digital master box can, gives us the opportunity with it. So we do not need to go in and you can also prognose this. So then we have here <coughs> also the human aspect because we will never get rid of humans in the production. We need the humans in the production. But uh, you see here, these are examples uh, for rigid coupling of machine to machine. Our demonstrator is generated in cooperation with wireless charging stations or smartphones. And you can see here in this dashboard, of course, you can see all the, the status. So if I close the door, then the door status uh, changes. So this is just for us to control all the things. But the most important is this, we call it the context sensitive guidance. And we can here do, for example, kind of self-test. So you see we do a lot of condition monitoring things. And so we want to make a test of the axis. And then we have for fa safety reasons, we have to make this one. And now we start with the test. And you see the robot makes a controlled movement. And you can see here the central data and the uh, access current. Important components for production. Professor Polt, he will give you an introduction about our strong field of additive manufacturing. Yes. Thank you so much. It's my great pleasure to give you some insights on our doing of the additive manufacturing. We are dealing basically with laser power battery. So a breakdown of supply chains due to the lightweight production. You can see here some, some specimens, some examples. Mm -hmm. Four additive materials actually could be applied on many parts of this. So this was divided into many sections. By using additive manufacturing, we can add these parts together and build very, very complex structures. Do you do it separately or do it one? This is one part. Yeah, it's one this part. is the burner head of the gas turbine. And when um, uh, the four additive manufacturing was applied to this part, it was separated into many parts, the three or four parts. Yes. But now we can add these together and save a lot of time and um, yeah, a lot of uh, production costs. So four so we produce from mm -hmm. this, I mean, separately we would produce something, something this, something this, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. but just so yes. I think you, you were working with classic. Greetings of Professor Ullmann. We had a telephone call yesterday, as I mentioned, 76 institutes. And uh, in 2022, these are old figures that result from 2021. Actually, we have more than uh, Steve Hugh Berlin, our partner here of our institute, the Max Planck Institute, or the Helmholtz Centers. They create basic innovations to 
support uh, logistical pro information and communication technology, micro electronics is very strong. We belong to the pro so called projection cluster of the front offices from our industrial funding and also public funding. 10% more than the whole cluster, more than 10%. Uh, technology cluster of the front office uh, society, uh, society, artificial intelligence, Brazil. We discussed about setting up of utmost importance for us uh, to support the transfer here, South uh, Africa, and also not to forget.